Okay, you guys can see I have the head on, like last time. <clears throat> Bunch of shop rags everywhere I have to clean up. But what I'm doing now is setting the cam timing. This piece of TIG wire is just to find top dead center, cylinder three. The zip tie is once I have the intake cam lined up, as you can see the marks, tension is off of it, or tension's in the right place on the chain, they're straight. Um, you can see in here, I'm on the eye mark. So now I'm setting the intake cam uh, while having this clamped down. So I'll snug these up, these bolts for the caps, verify that with the tensioner, you know, slightly snug, that everything's in the right place. Uh, you got these to refer to, the bolts to refer to. You can see how it shows you to line it up in the manual. So I'm going to do that and get the valve cover on. I'm actually going to set the valve lash, check the valve lash, and if I'm out of spec, I'm going to have to order shims. So let's do that right now. Okay, here we are with the cam alignment. So you can see marks there, marks there, marks there. Cylinder three is at top dead center as per the manual. This is the eye mark. So the mark right in front of the eye, big elongated eye. If you go to the other mark on the magneto, the cylinder one, the cylinder three is at bottom dead center, not top dead center, and the cylinder one is up. So let's get this torque down and buttoned up. Okay guys, um, I've rotated the engine a few revolutions and checked that the cam timing is correct. I've torqued all these to the 7.2 foot-pounds or 10 newton meters. Um, <clears throat> I have checked valve clearance. Uh, the lowest my gauges go are six thousandths, but six thousandths uh, is snug on pretty much all of them. So they're right around that six mark. These rear two, it's really tight. Um, but also the specification is a little over nine thousandths and I have a 10 thousandths gauge and a 10 thousandths gauge will not go in any of them. So they're between six and nine thousandths at the spec. Okay, here's this baby buttoned up. Uh, gonna get some new spark plugs because those were pretty hammered. Just burning oil and crap from what happened. But uh, you're gonna get new spark plugs, new oil filter, do probably a quick oil change right after I get it started just to flush everything out. The oil is cheap. Uh, get these little hoses, go through the whole thing and look for little details, get everything tightened up like these guys. And try to set it in the chassis.